Irish Republican Army was a revolutionary military organization made up of citizens and civilians. It formed as a response to the unwanted British control in Ireland. It was a group of Irish men and women who believed that Ireland should be a republic and wanted to govern themselves. The unrest about British control exploded during an event called Easter Rising in 1916, a combined rebellion enacted by the Irish Volunteers, the Irish Citizen Army, and the Come On No Man. Formed in Dublin in 1914 and largely active during this time of unrest, the Kaman Naman was an entirely female paramilitary force. The objective of the Kaman Naman, as stated in their constitution, was to advance the cause of Irish liberty. There were many fearless and powerful women involved in this organization. Their president, Constance Markovitz, was named as the second in command to James Connolly, the leader of the ICA during the rebellion. She also shot a police officer in the head during the hostilities of Easter Rising. Later, she received a death sentence for her work in Kaman Naman, although it was changed to lifelong servitude because she was a woman. Kaman Naman members were also instrumental in negotiating surrender when the rebel troops became overwhelmed by the strength of the British army. Elizabeth O'Farrell was the one to take the order of surrender to the troops fighting outside of Dublin. Seventy-four members of the Kaman Naman were imprisoned following the surrender. Some even died in the week-long uprising, such as Margareta Keogh, a volunteer. As the Irish continued to struggle for independence, the Kaman Naman split into different factions and became much less active. Today, Kaman Naman still exists and is recognized by the UK Terrorism Act of 2000 to be a domestic terrorist group, although it was not recognized as such by the US in 2008.